Hey, yo, where Nick at? Back there in the cut. I'm from Cartersville, Georgia. Single parent. Um, exit 288. Really came from not too much. Not just Ashton, but any kid. If you set your mind out and really mean it with your whole heart, then you'll be able to achieve anything that Get you want. Oh, my God. Right down the boulevard. Hagans is hungry. To do something for my family, so I'm gonna give it all I got. Grinding every day, I'm trying to get her to the knee. Pen and Mary pushing when I'm going to speed this. Five percent, ten when I'm sliding through the trenches. Straps to the trenches. Yeah, I'm Coach Rob, Rob Allen. I'm from Selma, Alabama. I'm a professional basketball trainer here in Atlanta. I've uh, been knowing Ashton since his 10th grade year in high school. Um, relationship goes way deep. It's more than just a trainer-player relationship. More is a little brother type relationship. Uh, been knowing each other a minute. Been in the gym numerous, numerous occasions and still to this day. Uh, just um, happy and thankful for what's the blessings that are coming to him um, just going throughout his whole career. I met uh, Ash through uh, his AAU coach, Chris Williams, um, when I was an up-and-coming trainer at the time. Uh, he told me he had a point guard from, uh, from Noon County that he wanted me to, to check out, uh, and it was Ashton. So uh, he got me in the gym with him. Uh, I still remember the, the night. Uh, it was at Grady High School. Uh, it was him and his dad, Marvin Higgins, uh, at that gym that night. Uh, and that's just how it started from us building a relationship at that time from, from working um, to where we are now. So that's how we met. Um, it's just been that, that big time relationship ever since then. Cartersville, uh, the city knew me, um, but not too many like outsiders knew me, like out of state. But the whole city knew me. Um, at seventh grade, you actually couldn't even play basketball sixth grade at Cartersville. But me and my, my boy Jay Pugh, um, we was real nice, so they changed the rules for us. We got to play my sixth grade year. Seventh grade, I went to Clements. Um, 
it was different than, than Cartersville because the people, um, it's actually out here in Covington in this area. Um, it was just different. Um, there wasn't a lot of hate. Um, it was just like family. Like when, once I got to school out here, uh, I got cool with everybody and just, it just felt, it felt like I was at home. grade year, that's when I started getting more recognition um, from people, um, video guys, uh, you know, coaches, getting invited to camps, things like that. Um, that's when people start like recognizing who I was, uh, start seeing that I really had talent. Um, and I would say like going into my ninth grade summer, eighth grade, going into my ninth grade summer, um, you know, I was just locked in like. I didn't know if I was going to do football or do basketball, so I was just working out, working out. Um, then it got to the point where I got to the high school, decided that just, that's when I started taking basketball real serious and just found out I could do something special with it. Summer, my eighth grade summer, ninth grade summer, it was just like a lot of speed and agility work going right around the corner from here, like five minutes from my house uh, to a little speed and uh, agility place called, uh, dang, what, it was, what I forgot it, what it was called. But they was getting me right. You know, we would go in there, do uh, one day it would be lifting, next day it would be rope day, um, things like that. But they was just getting me right, getting me um, bouncy, um, more explosive and just trying to get me better, trying to get me to reach some, reach my dream. We cooking it up. I got my boy Nick behind the scenes. I got my boy 1K with me. Loud day to day, we in, the, we in the lab trying to get better. That's all it is. Be back with y'all later. Um, sacrifices, man, you know. <laughs> uh, just for him, man, just getting in the gym. Uh, when he could have been out doing a lot of other things. But uh, for me, it was just sacrificing time, you know, getting up in the mornings, because I don't think people understand how hard that is, and I know people do it on a, a regular basis, but you being the top point guard in the country, uh, getting up in the mornings, putting up shots. Uh, we used to do sometimes two a days. I would go in the mornings and then we would go in the afternoon, just even doing games. Uh, every morning I was there working them out. My, my ninth grade schedule, uh, it was just get some grass and breakfast, um, then meet my trainer at the school. Some day it would be shot, some day it would be just dribbling. Um, and we would just get some work in. We would go for at least, we would go from like six to seven, six to eight sometimes, seven to eight. We would switch it up um, before school started. Just got some good work in. Um, ninth, 10th, 11th grade, that's, I was doing that every day, just getting some work in, get some breakfast every morning, go to the gym, boom, go home, shower, go back to school. That was just the same routine. 
um, that we just continued to do. I was trying to get better, trying to get to where I, I, I went to school at, college, Kentucky. Um, that was just my goal, just stay in the gym, uh, reach that goal. You know, I was committed to Georgia at first. Coach Fox left, uh, loyalty over anything, decided to leave with him, um, and went to Kentucky. That's, the, that's my bar, too. Get you right. Huh? Tell him you get me right. What time you off? I think I'm going to cut this. Uh, I got a couple of days, and I'm done. That? Yep. I see. I got you. All right, let's go, Nick. We in the crib with it. Hey, you grabbed a charger? Yeah. I'm about to shower real quick. Yeah. Got my little sisters posted on the wall. Boy, you mind? Am I tripping or it smells like baby food? I'm tripping. You don't smell that? Red vine. Red vine. Shot the red vine. What about the? That fucked me in, bless me. Come on. Tell her we're going to go ahead and sign the deal. Pickle sauce is just best up. Come on. <laughs> nah, but they. No need to get real. I, I gotta get to the lead. He don't even got an Xbox. They send him Xbox headphones. Like, I need that lifestyle. Oh, what? What, me? But stop talking like you just nice. <laughs> what? Just be talking. That's my son. Man, you better do your Google, your research. That's what I'm saying. Do your research. I'm Latrell, aka Doug, aka One K. You feel me? Aka the hardest person to touch the court. I'm Ash cousin. It's us who we get everything from. Like he want to be like me. That's why he with me so much. Like he want to be my son, but we don't get into that. He really, I ain't even gonna lie, out of all the kids, he was really tough, like, in every sport, I ain't gonna count him down, he was tough in football growing up, I ain't play football, I ain't got no business on no, on no field, if I would've played, though, him, number one wide receiver in the state, whatever, I, I would've been that, cause I'm, you feel me, but he was tough, tough on the court, if he would've stayed in the Ville, the Ville probably would've had about a three, four P, he would've been him, J. Pugh, TJ, them boys would have been going stupid. He came to Newton, though. He put on for the city. He really took Newton over. I don't even know really nobody from here. I know my boy JD. Shout out to Arkansas. He going fed out there. But he really came down here and took his over, too. Really crazy. I went to Cartersville. Really, all my life, my senior year, I, I transferred to Excel. I brought my ankle in my junior year. The coach at Cartersville, he, he didn't even want to play me no more, so I had to... Tell my talent somewhere else. Cool. Everything working out though. Still in the lab. Still trying to be great day by day. See you better day. Shout out to my boy C. Corey Bate. I really, I'm really my dogs. I don't really know him like that. I'm, I'm getting to know him though. I ain't met C yet though. Gotta be my boy. Gotta hoop with them boys too. Met Bate the other day. 350. Them boys cool. Be kicking it. Having good vibes. Only positive vibes around this way. You negative. Wouldn't want to talk to you. Kick you with you. None of that. No negative people around the squad. I'll tell you, boy. What he don't know is, he, I'm, finna, I'm probably finna take this. <laughs> Got to. Yeah. I don't know, that's what I said. I don't know what you talking about. Mm. Man, the parents are just out. You open them. 
Do I ever wear PSD? Oh, you have tried. Did I, did, did I wear it? You have tried. Did I wear it? You have tried. Did I wear it? And my question to you was, did you open it? Do I wear it? You have tried. It's not answering my question. I didn't ask you, did you wear it, bro? I, I said, asked did you, you open that. it? Exactly, so if I don't wear it, why don't I open it? You have tried to wear a pair. <laughs> but do I wear a pair, though? I'm at, that's why I asked you a question. Mm, 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 mm. What they say about hooping? He answered the phone. Uh, you know, eliminate on that. We keep them. Keep it about two or three on. Yo, Doug! Come on! Let go, bro. I was supposed to take these shoes too. Welcome to NTV Cribs. You feel me? This is the bathroom. Come in. We got lemonade. Come in. Use the bathroom. Take a sip of lemonade. Cut the good lotion, you feel me? Can't smell better than that. Yodorant. Gonna keep it right, smelling good. Toothpaste, gotta get right. We ain't got no cap on it, but you feel me? We don't need one. Got my babies with me. I don't care about nothing else, nobody else but these. And that's a fact. That number two, you see the NCAA tournament. Let's see what it's sticking right there. Number two. Come on. It's that real. It's that real 2020 vision. Feel me? Oh, uh, I ain't really switched numbers. Um, why they had it my freshman year, so I could I had to wait till my sophomore. But that's really you no know, the babies. They getting framed, most definitely. Look, y'all, look how bad he going out, bro. Crazy, crazy. What he say? But it's not Hayden. Bit, uh, my name is Brandon Wade. My name is Marvin Hagens. I'm Ashton's dad. Yeah, I'm uh, Ashton's brother. Ashton's big brother, but Ashton's brother, uh, Byron, Byron Davis. Yes, he, he, he lived in Cartersville when, uh, from, from his elementary and primary school to middle school days. Well, he moved out here from Cartersville to Covington with me in the seventh grade. Oh, that's crazy, for real. I, I really ain't think he would play basketball. I know he was always good at it. But I think he was better at football. I actually think football was his best sport. When Ashton moved from Cartersville to Covington, I mean, it was like, I don't know, we, we all knew it was for the better. He just like started taking basketball more serious. I started noticing he was doing like CSA on workouts. I told him, you know, if you just what you want to do, we got to do the training. It ain't just practice, we got to start training. And he bought into what I was saying. Um, city of Cartersville, a small town well known, everybody, I know you if you're from there. Um, but you know, it, it's just, it's a city where it's a lot of great hoopers, a lot of love. Like, too many people don't really make it out. Me, Ash, and like everybody else is in school. We just really try to stay on each other and you know, like stay in school. Some people say it's a curse on the city because when people leave, they can be gone for like a year and they'll come back. Like no matter what they're doing, like going to college for like sports or, or anything for real. A lot of people in the past have left and came back, but we trying to break that curse and change that wave. They won't even let me check my bank. I can't even check my bank. Hey, Jay. Let's go. <laughs> hey, what the vibes is tonight? What the vibes is tonight?
to me how to dug it. Yeah. Yeah. I see going there. Good jerk chicken and rice. Come on, man. You don't get no better than this. Eating great. For real. <laughs> Y'all need no longer, young boy. You got some cheese? What is it? Shall I eat it, Nick? I should eat it. Nah, that's not it, bro. Cabbage might be worth some. Need a little hot sauce. It's straight, though. It's straight. <laughs> Boy, you look like you rolled some boats. <laughs> Start doing what I gotta do. Nah, I'm gonna definitely stop by those times. Probably won't, you know, probably ain't gonna be there long. Probably just like a couple minutes hard. But look, but we got, nah, cause look, it's in the, we were in the building now. So we got like, we did like, um, strawberry shortcake. Did the whole back drop, face back. So it's gonna be nice. Four minutes though? I said four hours. Oh, I was about to say. No cap. So we used to run around these neighborhoods right here. Oh yeah, that's not crazy. And we leaving, right? Huh? We about to leave, right? I can't be out here. Love you, my boy. Love you, bro. It's a little secret, secret. Chicken Alfredo, come on, man. Y'all can ask Nick how it tastes too. I'll put them on for sure. Look out. It's like a minute from my house. I, I, I'll be walking the cut. Yo, we just posted, man. Where you at with it? I would have been all bad. Moving up to the date thinking I had some clothes. What? Where you trip, huh? What you mean? What you mean? White and these? What's wrong with that, bro? Tell me. You got purple trying to throw on with green. Because they he didn't even look at the color. He just seen the J's and, oh, yeah. Nah, the red. I was thinking Arkansas had purple in it, really. It's so fat. Oh, you just don't know how to drip. Like, let me, like, come on, Nick. Red, white, bro, come on. Bro. White. Look, bro, be real, bro. When this come out, wet go better. Please tell me. This what? gotta go on here. What you mean, white? I got on a black shirt. I, I don't have nothing white on except this. So you think this is gonna get, be real? So this is gonna get, put the shoe on. Put the shoe on, bro. Which one would look better than you, Nick? Left or the right? Thank you. That's all I gotta say. Why? I asked somebody else. I asked somebody. Hey, Quaint. Which shoe is um go better with this fit? Left or the right? Left. Go. Left. Sweet. Okay. The left got oh, purple. Okay. Right okay. Hard, uh, the right heart, you feel me? The right heart. The right heart, but, but, but the, the left, left going. Okay, that's yeah, three. Look, don't go. That's three. Oh, he that's only not, got one. That's not drip. <laughs> got it. You, you have, have on the look. You have on the look. A Nike drip. basketball shirt, right? Yeah. It's black though. These. It's black though. They got black. white. It's black. White. And the and the shoe got white. Red. White. Red. Yeah. Red. White. That's what I'm saying. Red. Like he really. Purple. The purple on the bottom. Just throw it off. Purple. It's so light purple. purple. Light. Right, no, I can do purple. that. Though. Hard, no. I can do that. Though. Purple. What? I'm, I'm going with hey, that in my closet. Like, the black gonna go stupid. That shit gonna stupid. go dumb. But you coming out my hit. closet. You see what I'm saying? And I ain't throwing. I'm putting you together. Oh, okay. No, no, no. You know what I'm saying? So I went to the So he gonna go from black to you. You feel me? You feel me? Nigga rolling with me, so I'm gonna. Sis on the phone. Talk to the cam, man. 
<laughs> Savannah State. Okay, you got to tell them the year. You got to tell them the year. Put them down. Talk to them. So, I go to Savannah State University, graduating December 2021. Yeah. Yeah. Period. Okay, then. <laughs> hey, what's the Instagram name? India Snapchat. India Monet. Twitter. <laughs> you done froze up on camera, huh? <laughs> but yeah, Ma, you need, we need to catch you on later. And that's the reason I still been on. Huh? I need it. At my old. What did it say? Yeah. Dang, I ain't even know that. At my old coach. Little league. We ain't lose. Hey, Sid. Yeah. How many little league games we lost? None. Come on, man. <laughs> For real. None. Ain't no cap, right? Ain't no cap. Anybody. Me, Evan. Me, Evan. Who else? Me and Evan was really the team. Evan but Williams. Williams. Dreadhead Ev Hooper was cold. What gave you a bucket? Are oh, you talking about basketball? Boogie, yeah. <laughs> I had to go and get it, put it in the world, trying to grind and get a million. All my family hate the hate.